My name is Ralph Bell. I'm the Facility Manager at the South Carolina Law Enforcement Division. Uh, one of the first projects that, that I was able to do here um, through a grant through the Energy Office was replacing our age chillers. They were uh, established in 1990 here at the lab and over the years we've done a numerous repairs. They're very, very big uh, energy usage out of both of those chillers. So with the, that grant, what we were able to do was replace it with the modern McQuay chiller, and we've seen a huge reduction over the last three years. We've cut our consumption at the forensic lab by 10% every year, which is just, you know, with, with our bills over here, 10% is thousands and thousands of dollars. Some of the other projects that we've looked at doing, and. Um, some of the folks at the energy office were actually instrumental in helping us uh, think about some of these is the occupancy sensors. We uh, have done a lot of renovations here and there at the lab and while we were doing them we thought well why not try this out and we found that um, with the 24-7 schedules of our crime scene department and our latent prints department that this has really helped because they can come in, in and out and do their work and not have to worry about you know turning the lights on and off which in, a, in, in that kind of environment is a, is a big help. We have an a aviation hangar which stores four of our helicopters that the uh, SWAT team uses and um, over the years those metal halide lights have become uh, aged and you know we're replacing them constantly 250 watt um, metal halide lamps and we had over uh, 16 of them so we looked at actually replacing them with the high bay T5 fixtures and we found that you know our energy consumption went way down. Um, we do have gas heaters in there too so while we were doing this project and had the equipment we went ahead and put some uh, relays because what would happen is during the winter we'd have all of the six gas heaters running and you'd go to open those doors, roll the helicopter out for a call and the gas heaters would continually run what we did was we put a switch and when that door is open the gas heaters turn off. So it was a, it was a very good uh, dual usage project for us. Another um, kind of a side project we did working with the energy office, I'd go over there and talk to some of the employees, was uh, ICF gives various grants through SCNG and uh, we started applying for some of those. Uh, we applied for uh, uh, some of our other little lighting projects and uh, some LED replacement on the exterior of the aviation building. And uh, a rebate project is kind of a, a good little incentive. It just offsets uh, uh, some of these costs. The other project that we're in the middle of is replacing um, all the power emergency supply for our computer data room. It also comes off another building. So we have a project that's going to separate that. While we were doing the actual power part of it, which is generators and battery backup, we realized that the aging HVAC system in there was costing us over $12,000 a year to repair. And what we've done is we've replaced four units with three units, and the new Liebert units all talk to each other. That project's uh, supposed to be done in, by July of 2015, and we think we're going to have some uh, real big savings out of that.